Hornet Baseball hosted UCO this weekend, falling to the Broncos 2-1 in the series. Emporia State took Game 1 with a 5-1 win, then UCO evened the series with an 11-5 win in Game 2. The Hornets lost a heartbreaker in the series finale with UCO scoring two runs late for the 2-1 win in a pitcher's duel. I think really all year uh, we've put ourselves in pretty good position to win games um, and against really good teams and then and sometimes we do, sometimes we don't. And just got to find a way to start winning those one-run games. Four of the Hornets' losses on the season have come by just one run. In this conference, like you get, it's a battle every single day for every single pitch. Uh, put ourselves in a position to win, and at some point, we just we got to find find ways to win those one one run games rather than lose them. Over the weekend, Brady Mitchell hit 416 with two runs, and Chandler Bloomer batted 333 with two runs and two RBIs. In the series finale, starting pitcher Drew Rep allowed just one run on four hits and struck out five in eight innings of work. I mean, Drew Rep was as good as we've seen him. I mean, he was he was awesome today, um, and that's a really good team over there. The Hornets are back in action this weekend hosting Central Missouri at Tressler Sports Complex. A lot of the things we need to keep doing the same and then um, we're, we're, the, these next two days we're probably just going to take it really really easy on them, uh, let them kind of get away from it, clear their heads a little bit and then get back after it next week and have a really good week of practice.